folks, Todd with Survival Sherpa. Out here at the cabin site today and uh, wanted to build a ladder. Uh, I've got a 10 step ladder over there. Uh, it's kind of rickety, but uh, anyway, this is just a quick down and dirty way to make a, uh, a ladder for anything that you need in the woods uh, at your fixed camp or wherever you're, you're working. We'll go ahead and double this up and uh, we'll tie me a piece of paracord or something on there just to make sure we got it in the center. Alright, that's our center line or center mark. Now I don't lose it again. Since we're at the ends here, we'll just do a uh, Toss a clove right here. I'll turn it over so you can see it, but yeah, got us a clove hitch here. I'm gonna wrap that back around and get it about centered up before I tighten it down. Remember, this is my center mark right here, so uh, I need to bring a little bit more that way. All right, so for that first clove hitch, I've got it going there and back under so it's really um, that's about seven so we're going to do the same thing over here So we've got one half hitch there. We'll make another one here. All right, I'm gonna spread it out just a little. Save on my wrongs. Same thing here, keep doing that half hitch all the way up. There. Um, it's nothing but a series of half hitches all the way up or down whichever way you're going on this uh, on these two spars here and uh, just uh, keep them about even and uh, work your way all the way down Go ahead and show you what this is going to look like. So we go ahead and insert one of our rungs here. Get it about even. Put another one in just like that. Um, we're going to tie off a permanent brace here with a separate line so as to keep this, these two uh, spars right here, uh, keep them in place so that they're not widening and that kind of thing. Bring it under. There's several people who've got tutorials on how to tie this knot so um, I'll put a link in the bottom of some of my favorites
So now that we've got this stabilized up here, we've got one at the bottom, we're going to insert rungs and uh, we'll set this thing up. Put another clove in over here and terminate it that way. Okay. Let's tie uh, one more. I just don't want that coming off anytime when I'm up in the air. Okay, let's go set it up. Start inserting our lungs. There it is. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten rungs. Could put one more in up here, but uh, you know we can we can climb up this thing all the way up here. And this is this top part up here where the ropes come across. That's where I wanted that because it grips it, it grips half the diameter of the tree. Uh, the circumference of the tree. So, um, and this axe handle right here will keep it from, uh, just keep it in the same same width the whole time we're using it. So, anyway, that's it. So, uh, that's the bushcraft ladder, and it um, doesn't take that long to, to put together. Um, you're just tying half hitches down that down both spars pretty much. Um, but if you got some, some limbs, I mean, it doesn't have to be. Uh, very large trees. For, for mine, I'm using just uh, eastern red cedar. And um, then the rungs, just a mix of uh, saplings that I've had cut down here and uh, threw them in there. So, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this. And um, <laughs> we'll hope you guys keep doing stuff self-reliance. And uh, we'll get some cabin footage for long.